I think I only have one item in here that's new from... Sophie Robertson um, is proud that almost her entire wardrobe is secondhand. This was secondhand. These were secondhand. I think they had never been worn before. She used to shop at fast fashion chains like Zara and H&M, but no more. I don't want to be a part of, you know, polluting the planet. We have so much out there already. Shopping secondhand to save money has always been popular, but now concern for the environment is a growing factor. Clothing waste is like one of the biggest pollutants, so this is obviously helping because we're not buying more new clothes. All the fast fashion these days are just like polluting our earth with the climate change and all that. According to a recent survey, there's a shift underway in Canadian attitudes. Classified advertising website Kijiji has just released its fifth annual report on the second-hand economy. It asks survey participants about what motivates them, and this year cost is down 4%, while altruistic and ecological reasons are up by 6%. When I was growing up, it was, you know, not, not as cool to wear secondhand clothing. And this district well. manager at Value Village says sales are growing. The stigma of shopping at thrift stores is fading. It, it represented people not having the money to, to spend on new clothing. And that was probably the stigma around it, but it's completely different now. Even online retailers of used clothing have sprung up. Poshmark and ThreadUp are both American companies that have expanded to Canada. We've been seeing the secondhand market since we started doubling. The co-founder of ThreadUp was in Toronto recently to speak at a conference. It's going to double again in the next uh, 10 years. Chris it Homer says in terms of growth, used clothing sellers are clobbering regular retail. The fact that we're seeing secondhand growing at a 16% oh, year over year, doubling every five to 10 years rate, that's just not something, that's just a completely different trend shift that's happening within the, the market. Thrift shops are evolving too. Some look and smell more like high-end boutiques than the Salvation Army or Goodwill. Even so, some consumers may never come around to second hand, although Sophie Robertson asks, why not? And my husband has been here and he was like, are you sure that's a secondhand shop or that's a consignment shop? I'm like, yeah, it is. Unique styles, bargains, and a clear conscience in terms of climate change. It's a winning combination for a growing group of consumers. Diane Buckner, CBC News, Toronto.